what's going on guys welcome to another video and today we'll be learning on how to disable previous dates in our app when we do a data entry but before that i would like to say thank you for your support i've been uh, away for quite some time and basically there's a lot of uh, comments and questions which uh i am very happy to see the participation it's increasing over time and there's a lot of questions that, that i'm yet to answer including emails so hanging there i will address all of them one at a time so again uh, i was a bit busy with uh, learning new things when it comes to google workspace a lot of new things coming in soon uh, including gemini uh, which was previously known as BART, uh, a new AI that would definitely transform the way we do things within the Google Workspace environment. So back to the video. So this uh, is actually coming from an email that I received by Sarah. Uh, the question is, how do I um, make, ensure that data entry won't allow dates from the previous days? Uh, so this is actually doable using the valid if in AppSheet. So without further ado, let's check it out. Okay, guys. So to start off the demonstration. So as you can see, we have the tables set up in this way, such as we have the unique ID, task, description, date, and added by. So all of this falls under the transaction table for this case. And of course, we can uh, proceed by creating the app in appsheet.com. So once we have that, uh, head on to the data section in the app um, builder. So the main focus that we want to look at is the date itself, since we want to ensure that any uh, addition data to the app itself would not allow any dates uh, before today. Uh, as long as it's today or later, it's fine. So to do that, head on to the data validity section of your uh, uh, editor. Here you will find the first, which is the valid if, and we are using date uh, as the date is valid as long as it's more or equals to today. Okay, so it's very simple and quick and easy. And of course, for the error message that we want to tell to our users, if say that the data added is not valid, in this case, if date is less than today, then date must be greater or equals to today. So this is the error message that will be displayed. Else then it is true. True means nothing will be displayed. Okay. So to give you some uh, perspective to it, let's head on to add a new data. So subscribe to my channel. And for those who are watching, thank you for your time. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. So description, let's put testing. So the date today is the 10th of July. So let's say if I were to add a new data and the date is a day before than 10, then the display will show an error message saying that the date must be greater or equal to today. It's supposed to be equals to today. Then let's say if I put any dates before, let's say in June, the same error will appear. Unless if I made it today, then it would allow or any dates in advance more than 10 of July. And you can proceed to save the data. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you find this useful. 
and of course so that you may find more contents like this in the future don't worry guys i'll be uh, posting more videos and i will double up the amount from time to time to com uh, compensate back the days that i haven't posted before and again thank you very much guys for your support and i hope to see you guys in the next video so take care bye bye